She's on a warpath right now and it's tearing up Twitter and social media outlets as we speak. This day is all about the survivor and the attacker and a day in remembrance of what happened in the 90s. It's being considered as a terrible attack that happened in the White House that left a young woman's reputation damaged and a president impeached. This is the story of Bill Clinton and Monica Lewinsky and she's celebrating her 20th year of that horrible time in American politics. The White House was disgraced, a woman's dress defaced, and everyone in the world had their eyes on the White House as an impeachment process added to the fledgling reputation of former President Bill Clinton. Monica Lewinsky claims she's a survivor after what happened with her sexual encounter with Bill Clinton. Some call it an attack. Some call it mutual. Everyone calls it repulsive because Bill Clinton was caught in a raunch she exposed with an intern while he was married to Hillary Clinton. But Hillary didn't leave his side. She stayed on the path of politics, not caring much about what her husband was into, or putting into, and she used Bill's name and reputation to push her career forward while he took a backseat after his romp with Lewinsky. Bill Clinton was probed 20 years ago and the memory and backlash of the sexual encounter have always left a stain on the reputation of Lewinsky. That didn't stop her from being successful in her ventures after the impeachment of Bill Clinton. She refused to allow the incident with the former president of the United States to stop her in on the path to success. She pushed forward, full steam ahead, and she brandished herself a survivor. She wasn't physically attacked with punches, kicks, or weapons. But her character was nearly assassinated. She went from being an intern to a name everyone knows. People know her, her dress, and something about cigars that we won't get into. And now, still, Lewinsky pushes on as she claims herself a survivor from what was possibly her most tumultuous year.